You know, occasionally we find ourselves in difficult or burdensome life situations, then receive sudden unexpected blessings. A very generous gift was recently provided to a local waiter experiencing some difficulties, as we see in tonight's Good News with Doppler Dave. I had the honor of meeting Enrique Guzman this week. Like most restaurant servers, he works some long, hard hours. But Enrique loves what he does. I'm a waiter for the time. I love it. I like to interact with people sometimes. Uh, and, uh, I'm not real friendly sometimes, but I'm nervous still after 25 years. I love it. I love, I love talking to people. I know a lot of people. Enrique is just one of those special servers that is appreciated and loved by both customers and co-workers. Most generally, he's very humble, he's very courteous, and he likes the servitude of serving the guests. Earlier this year, unfortunately, Enrique developed some serious health issues. Uh, around January, I got a problem in my prostate. I broke a collapse in my kidneys. So I started in dialysis at that time. They took it off and then they released me from the hospital. I was in the hospital for two weeks. During his time away in the hospital, some regular patrons began to notice his absence. You know, the people they asked for me, they was worried about it. After his first hospital stay and mounting medical debt, he returned to work but was still in poor health. I need to work the most possible to pay my bills. And then another hospitalization. And that's when an unexpected blessing came out of nowhere from a concerned couple that are regular customers. Customers are used to tipping their waitress, you know, suggested 20, 25, 30 percent. But for Ron Reed, they got much more than just a standard tip. When I open the chest, I'm kidding me. <laughs> and I'm back, I say, wow, I checked $10,000 plus my tip. <laughs> so it was good. <laughs> the $10,000 gift touched him deeply. I feel butterflies on my stomach. And I was in shock for maybe 20 minutes. They made me cry. Because <laughs> I think they love me. I always believe in God. First, have faith. Expecting that mistake. This is coming. There's just something about seeing somebody who serves others for a living get served his own gift of generosity. Now that's some good news. I'm Doppler Day for News Channel 10. And now.